hey guys welcome back to another how to video now in this video we'll talk about how to run swift code for windows so for that you can go to swift for windows.github.io and from there you can download this package download it and once it is downloaded you can go to swift for windows 2.0 to uh, you can also say 2.0 and just hit enter and once you hit enter it will ask you to install it click on yes and saying that Swift for Windows already installed it's a normal installation package and once you go with it now what you have to do uh, just open uh, click next and nothing else I'm just going to quit and here you can open this file okay once you open this file it will ask you to run a code okay but before running a code you do need to compile the code first and now those who don't understand what is a compiled language or what is a, an interpreted language let me tell you that swift is a compiled language it means ki agar hindi mein samjhe to swift ek compiled language hai jo kya karega aapka yahan pe ek hamara paas ek translator hai ab computer mein translator do tarike se ho sakte hai compiled ya interpreted ab jo compiled ya karega yahan pe aapne code likha theek hai ab jo compiled ya karega is code ko pura all at once फिर इसको ऑल एट वंस को कम्प्लीटली रीड करेगा उसके बाद आपको आउटपुट देगा और अगर आपके पूरी फाइल में एक भी एरर आता है तो ये आउटपुट नहीं देने वाला सही है और इंटरप्रेटेड में क्या है कि आपने ये पूरा अपना कोड लिखा तो ये लाइन बाय लाइन तो इसको आउटपुट देता रहेगा और अगर आप कंपाइल्ड की तरह अगर इस पूरे कोड को एक साथ रन करते हो ठीक है पूरी फाइल को एक बार में सेव करके फिर रन करते हो तो सपोज करते हो आपकी पहले की पाँच लाइन सही है और बाद में की गलत है तो ये आपको क्या करेगा पहले की पाँच लाइन का आउटपुट दे देगा और बाद में का नहीं देगा यानी बाद में जहाँ पे आपके प्रोग्राम में एरर आया वहाँ स्टॉप कर देगा और उससे पहले जितना भी ठीक था उन सबका आउटपुट देता हुआ चला जाएगा तो यार ये बेसिक सा डिफरेंस है कंपाइल और इंटरप्रेटेड लैंग्वेज में अब स्विफ्ट क्या है कंपाइल लैंग्वेज में यानी अगर एक भी एरर है तो आपका कोड रही रन होगा तो कोड वहीं रुक जाएगा तो अब हम चलते दोबारा से टेक्सट एडिटर पर नाउ जस्ट मूविंग बैक टू टेक्स एडिटर इट्स अप टू यू यू कैन चूज एनी ऑफ द टेक्सट एडिटर वेदर इट्स लाइक विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड सब लाइन एटम नॉट ब्रैकेट्स Yes, you can also choose not at all, sir. But in my case, I am going to choose the Visual Studio. Okay, let me say Visual Studio Code. Okay. So once you open Visual Studio Code, uh, wait for a while. Okay, here it is. Now let's say control N. Oops. Now here, instead of plain text, I'm going to say it that I'm writing Swift code. Okay. And let me just copy. Ah, uh, let me copy nothing. Okay. So I'm just going to print hello world. So print hello world. so once you write this command just save it and go to on desktop and say it wow dot swift this is the extension by which you must save your swift file so once you save it okay just say it to select file and now say it to wow dot swift and open it once you open it if you try to run directly it won't run it will say compile first so you have to compile it first once you compile it it will prompt you a message that it compiled successfully uh oh wait for a while it may not take this much time in your system it essentially depend upon the hardware configuration of your system what's the ram size or blah blah so here it is successfully compiled now let's run it so the moment i click on run it gives me hello world so i hope you like this video you got how do we run swift code on a windows system okay and one more an important and good news for you if you want a swift playlist you want to develop app in swift using windows or mac os you can like make a comment below and do as many like as possible if there are about 50 person who want a playlist i will surely make that playlist so if you want a playlist on swift iska matlab agar aap bhi android like ios applications banana chahte hain to aap ek comment kijiye usse like karwaiye is video ko share kijiye aur hum definitely wo playlist mein aayenge That's it. Bye-bye.